Now, Blaine is Jordan. You're setting up the last touches for the surprise party for Emma. With your friends. Nope, oh, this looks good. It can't be. It has to be great. This is one, my one shot over winter break to do the perfect party. I refuse to be subpar. Uh, it'll be fine. Morgan and Co. and Michael are, are working on the poster. Hanum and Wes are handling balloons. And Sydney and Caleb will be here with Streamer soon. Soon isn't now. Maybe all, or more specifically one of us, needs a break while we check in on everyone? I'll do the checking. As Peyton escorts Marie outside, you pull out your phone and open the party planning group text. ETA on Emma's gift. How's the poster coming along? Morgan? Co? Michael? Anyone? Hang on to your grandmas. Can't rush art. The poster will get there when it gets there. Emma's supposed to show up soon. D don't worry, Jordan. We're painting on a couple more things. Then gotta wait for it to dry. Waiting for watching paint dry is so boring. Um, how are we doing on the other party supplies? Okay, uh, Sid and I are at the store now. Got the streamers! We're, um, on our way. Awesome. It's gonna look so good. Calling Balloon Squadron! How goes your mission? Well, we've got a pretty limited selection. Um, what do you mean? Well, take your pick. Which one of these says, Welcome home, Emma Moore. Happy fifth birthday, or happy anniversary. We could always do sorry for your loss, but I don't think that's very on theme. Uh, go with, uh, fifth birthday balloons. Anniversary, why not? She's coming home. Uh, it's a little romantic, but still fun. I guess it could be the anniversary of her coming home? Yeah, it's perfect. Okay, got him. Be at your house soon. Jordan, guess who just landed? Uh, Emma just texted me. Jordan, guess who just landed? Hmm, the Prince of Cordonia? Oh, I wish. So if it's not him, does that mean you just landed? You got it. I gotta go to baggage claim, and then my mom's gonna drop me off at your place. Can't wait! We're gonna have so much fun. Just what I needed. She just landed. Emma needs to get uh, her bags, and then she's on her way here. Streamer, goofed, balloon groups... Return to base now! A few minutes out. Same here! How's this turn out? Still waiting for some people to show up. Like you guys. Eh. Be there soon. We're here. Uh, does this mean we win? Not everything is a competition, pretty boy. You hear the doorbell ring. No, the hall. Your dad opens the front door. Jordan's room is just down the hallway. Glad you can be a part of the party. Caleb and Sydney stride into your room carrying rolls of multicolored streamers. Uh, we're here. This is great. Love your room, Jordan. I know. Uh, glad you both made it. Less talking, more decorating. Calm the hell down, woman. Use your friends to unroll the streamers and hang them up around your room. This looks so good. And just then, Wes and Autumn enter the room, carrying your balloon. Made it with totally appropriate balloons. Uh, because nothing says welcome home like happy anniversary. I hope Emma will like it. Yeah, we're just missing Co, Morgan, and Michael. Uh, poster squadron? Everyone's here. Where are you? Uh, just down the road. Oh, shoot. 
Eh, we can flank her. Flank up now. My mom just parked. Oh, cool. Come on in. Red alert! Red alert! Emma's here! Everyone hide! Your friends spring in action, scrambling to find a hiding place in your room. You duck behind your bedroom door and peer through the crack to see down the hallway. Poster crew, be careful, she's coming in now. We know, we're outside. Behind Emma. Like, you see her? No, they see her ass. What do you think? She's walking in now. I can hear my dad talking to her now. I'm so excited. She's gonna love this. Me too. Me three. I see her down the hallway. Thank God we're all texting this. Get ready, everyone. Three, two, one. Go, 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 go. This is so stupid. As soon as Emma walks in and your friends hop, pop out from your hiding spots. Surprise! Welcome home. We missed you. Oh, what is all this? I know you were having a hard time at your dad's. We wanted to do something to cheer you up. This is so thoughtful. Happy anniversary. Why did you get these? That's all the star hat. It's kind of like your anniversary home, right? Yeah, that's a good way to put it. <laughs> you discreetly glance at your next text. Incoming! Ready or not, here we come. There's one more thing to your surprise party, too. Just then, Co, Morgan, and Michael follow him into the room holding a rolled up poster. We pitched in and made you something. Three of them unfurl the poster, revealing a gratified welcome home, Emma. That is amazing. Yeah, great job on the poster. Can we at least see that? No. Thank you guys so much. It was nothing. Yeah, this is an excuse to paint stuff. Anyway, we're so glad you're back, Emma. Me too. I can't thank you enough. Later that night, after the party winds down, you and your friends go separate ways. Eventually, you crawl into bed and text Emma. Did you enjoy yourself? You've got no idea. I was so worried I'd leave for a couple weeks and be forgotten. I didn't want to be left behind. Ah, uh, there's no way we'd let that happen. Yeah, it's hard to even consider that after tonight. I'm so lucky to have such a, such a special people in my life. Not as lucky as we are to have you. I can't believe I'm saying this, but I can't wait for school to start. You know what? Neither can I. You start to drop, drift off to sleep, a smile on your face. This year is going to be so much fun. <sighs> okay. Mm. Without further ado, thank you all for watching. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe if you at least enjoyed what I do. Otherwise, I still don't... I, I, I'm, I'm just going to say it, okay? The whole book started with, you know, by the way, this insert happens here, yada, yada, yada. Um, and if you haven't played that, you should play it before doing this. And, you know, I was like, okay, well, we've already done that. We've done that, like, what, seven years ago, give or take? You know what I'm saying? Like, it's it's been a, it's been a long time since we did High School Story. And I swear this is an attempt for them to do nostalgia so you go back and spend some diamonds if you haven't already like me i already did um to, to cover all the diamond choices and everything and you know hey guys make sure to click our app or even reinstall you know it'll get you really hooked you know what i i don't know man listen don't do it don't do it if you're thinking about doing it don't do it um the, like the reason why i say that is just you had the mail options right like let's put it this way we didn't even get to import anything that happened right so n nothing we did made any difference whatsoever we had the mail right option look horrible they didn't even graphically do it right and that's to say a lot because these textbooks came out before pixelberry 
got bought out by that new place, right? So they did this under Nexon, where they had a bunch more money. They had infinite resources. They squandered that. Literally le left Nexon. That's why Nexon sold them. Because they, they literally just gobbled up money from Nexon. And and here we are with just... Uh, it just irks me. Just just irks the shit out of me. Um, yeah, no, again. And then, like... I mean, the only thing good about this little tech story was we got to see a couple relationship things kind of blossom, or at least, not really blossom, but at least, like, behind the scenes. That was the closest we got. That was it. Otherwise, I was really not impressed with this stuff. I don't know. Let me know your thoughts down below. Um, like, it dawned on me that, yeah, we went with the female thing, because, you know, um, I, I was like, what happened? And, you know, I, I'd listen, I, I don't know. My brain was off, but I do remember that we had to select the female option because the male option was horrible. The hair, just, again, they did hor. It, it's the worst. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest with you. It's actually the worst job that they've ever done. And it's funny because, you know, think about this. Just I'll leave you with this little note before we end. So Pixelberry literally and figuratively went back and they changed a lot of characters' faces, right? Remember the guy that used to look like Chris Evans? They changed him. Remember the guy who used to look like um, Michael B. Jordan? They changed him. Like, they went back and, and they, they pretty much copy and pasted celebrities to be put in this book. Or not this book, but, you know, this app. And then they had to go back and change it because everyone's like, uh, you guys are literally and figuratively just copying and pasting. Right? Not to mention the thumbnails or book covers, Right? I can think of a few cowboy ones off the top of my head that were literally and figuratively copied from, air quote, steamy romance books of cowboys. I'm not even kidding. Let alone uh, a lot of the book covers over the years, we've figured out that a lot of them were copied and pasted. They were edited significantly, like, well, not significantly, slightly. Um, animated up, and then like, hey, look, here, here, here you go, here's your, here's your copy for Bloodbound, here's your copy for this romance book, here's a, like, I'm starting to wonder, <laughs> has Pixelberry ever had an original thought besides High School Story? Like, and by the way, that came from EA, so, have they, I'm just asking, have they ever had an original thought? Like, and they don't now, let's be honest. They they really don't now. So anyway, I know, I'm, I need to shut up. Thanks for watching. I just, I get to talking about this stuff because I once loved this app and it's just irking me at this point. Thanks for watching. Catch you all later. Peace out.